you should not go back there because there is a bad price with your name. Don't take it lightly. These things, they don't discriminate. They can plot to kill you no matter how anointed you are. The book of John chapter 7 verse 1, it says Jesus would walk from place to place, but he would no longer go or walk in Judea because the Jews were plotting to kill him and he was away. So you see, Jesus also knew when to be careful. He was not a God or a man of God or a, a Messiah or a son of God who just walk whenever he feels like, yeah, I have God. No, he was also walking according to the direction and the guidance of the Holy Ghost. Where he needed to be careful, he would be careful. Where he needed to dodge. Remember one, at one point when he began preaching, they wanted to throw him from a cliff of a mountain, but then he escaped them. You get what I'm saying? He knew when to run. He knew when to hide. And he knew when to stand firm. You know what I'm saying? So that is what you must also know and learn and do. I have, I don't know as I was growing, but I can understand that it is due to maturity and the absence of the shortage of knowing the word of God, how God works. And we learn, we grow. Nobody wakes up and you know it all. You get what I'm saying? But one common thing that I believe even to this day, most Christians have a problem with is to not understand how God operates. When you think you are being courageous, I don't fear e the uh, witches, I walk. You don't know when to hide when you're supposed to. You don't know when to be brave when you're supposed to. At a place where you're supposed to be brave, you hide. At a place where you're supposed to hide, you act brave and you get killed, you get hurt. You got what I'm saying? So the bottom line is, you must know there are places where you're not supposed to show up. There are things or food you're not supposed to eat because there is poison. Instead of you, of using that scripture that says you shall drink deadly poison, nothing shall harm you. You need to avoid that food altogether. A time will come where you will accidentally, you heard what I said, accidentally eat, eat that food, drink that poison. And that is when you call out, Lord, I have drank poison. I was not aware. I was not testing you. They were blood dead. Uh, they were trapping me. Save me, O oh God, and he will save you. The Lord says, call unto me in the day of trouble and I will rescue you. So you see, those are the moments you use scriptures. But when you know, when you've been tipped that they want to kill you, don't eat. Don't eat and you will be safe. Don't go to that place. I pray for everyone that is watching right now. Wherever they had set a trap against you, and they said you're going to fall into that pit, onto that trap, you will not fall. I decree and I declare over your life that you must be protected. Amen. And of course, you can book an appointment with me. My details are on the comment section below. See you next time.